Now an important Consumer Reports test for parents and caregivers to hear. It looked at dressers and their chances of tipping over, possibly injuring or killing a child. It found dressers measuring 30 inches tall or shorter have even been linked to deaths. That shows just because it's small doesn't make the dresser less of a risk in your home. Every 17 minutes, an unsecured piece of furniture, appliance, or television tips over and injures or kills someone in the U.S. Most of the victims are children under six years old. During Consumer Reports' ongoing investigation into the stability of dressers, newly released government data shows dressers 30 inches tall and shorter have been linked to deaths. We found that just because a dresser is low and seems stable, like one that's three drawers high, it can still pose a deadly tip-over risk to small children in your home. Records released in June showed that at least five fatal tip-overs were linked to dressers that measured 30 inches or shorter. As part of its continued analysis, Consumer Reports conducted three tip-over tests on 17 dresser models marketed as measuring 30 inches tall and shorter to see if they are prone to tipping over. Only five of the dressers passed all of Consumer Reports' tests, including the $150 IKEA Nordly, showing that a stable, affordable dresser at this height is possible. Companies have the ability to do something about this epidemic. We've found that it is possible to build more stable dressers of any height. And our findings highlight the need for strong safety standards for all dressers, not just taller ones. Which is why Consumer Reports is pushing for mandatory safety standards for dressers of all sizes and says all furniture should be properly anchored to a wall. There's a really helpful video we've posted on newsforjacks.com that shows you how to properly mount a dresser to your wall. Also, you can read the full list of dressers that passed and those that failed. Just go to newsforjacks.com slash consumer.